Now we'll look at what 12 on Health reporter Gillian Neff is working on for our evening newscasts. We're headed into laser treatment for acne. It's marketed as an alternative to the very strong medication known as Accutane. So the light emitted is a high burst of energy. You can see the patient react. It feels um, like a little pinch with heat. Worth it? Yeah. How come? Um, just going out in public and I don't have to worry about having acne. Any scarring. I'm Gillian F. in Greenwich. We'll show you how it works in your 12 on Health report and what else the treatment entails. We'll have that for you in later newscasts. In this evening's 12 on Health report, we take you inside a Greenwich doctor's office to see how a high tech acne treatment works. Hey, here's 12 on Health reporter Gillian F. Gillian. It can make teenage life really tough acne. Now, the teenage patient we met with has been in treatment with this doctor for a while. So at this point, her acne treatment is designed to keep flare ups away. The teen's mom says she sought this treatment originally to avoid putting her daughter on the strong acne medication Accutane that has been linked to liver damage. She was first diagnosed with moderate to severe acne throughout her forehead and the sides of her cheeks. So the light emitted is a high burst of energy. I'm blasting her skin at the superficial level and it's penetrating both the surface and a little bit deeper to kill the bacteria. That's ultimately responsible for the flare-ups and the inflammation. Greenwich dermatologist Dr. Karen Soika uses a wand to apply intense pulse light therapy to 16-year-old Jacinia Santiago's face. Dr. Soika says studies show that this photodynamic therapy can help clear up acne and reduce scarring in cases like this and this. To begin the procedure, the doctor applies medication to the surface of Jacinia's face, then puts her in front of a red and blue light board to help her skin absorb the medication that will be activated by the intense pulse light. Patients tend to grimace a little bit during. It feels um, like a little pinch with heat. A patient such as Jess can expect clearing within one month to three months with improvement up to six months. However, more advanced cases may require a treatment every uh, two to three weeks up to three to five treatments. And it is not cheap. Dr. Soika says each treatment session costs $500 and it does not tend to be covered by insurance. For more about this treatment and other acne information from the Academy of American Academy of Dermatology, go to our website, news12.com. She was first diagnosed with moderate to severe acne throughout her forehead and the sides of her cheeks. So the light emitted is a high burst of energy. I'm blasting her skin at the superficial level and it's penetrating both the surface and a little bit deeper to kill the bacteria. That's ultimately responsible for the flare ups and the inflammation. Greenwich dermatologist Dr. Karen Soika uses a wand to apply intense pulse light therapy to 16-year-old Jacinia Santiago's face. Dr. Soika says studies show that this photodynamic therapy can help clear up acne and reduce scarring in cases like this and this. It's marketed as an alternative to the very strong medication known as Accutane. To begin the procedure, the doctor applies medication to the surface of Jacinia's face, then puts her in front of a red and blue light board to help her skin absorb the medication that will be activated by the intense pulse light. Patients tend to grimace a little bit during. It feels um, like a little pinch with heat. A patient such as Jess can expect clearing within one month to three months with improvement up to six months. However, more advanced cases may require a treatment every uh, two to three weeks, up to three to five treatments. I'm 12 on Health reporter Gillian Neff, and that's your Medical Minute.